So how can you get started with R and Python? Here we have the Omics Logic Playground. All you need to do is click on Get Started for Free. You log in using your account or you create an account right here. Let me sign in. And start off with the very first module, Getting Started with Bioinformatics in R. We click here, you'll see a brief overview of why we started the Code Playground and you have the first several lessons that you can start working on. Just read about the code and then try to do it yourself. Importing and viewing a text file. Let's run it. Error running code. Why is that? We need to read the instructions. Let's copy this link. Replace it here. Let's clear and run it again. All right, great. Now, we're successful. Let's keep on going. Here's some Excel files, CSVs, etc. Try some other ones. Once you complete this lesson, go back to all the courses. Now we can visualize this data. Let's try to visualize. Now there's many different types of data, categorical, continuous. So let's read about how to work with such data. Let's try it yourself. So here we're working with a gene expression table. We can replace this link again. Let's run it. If something goes wrong and I've messed up, I just need to press here, run it, and the answer is correct. So the data set that we were loading here was much smaller, 14 rows by 52 samples. Now we can take this data and visualize it. We can make a box plot, and we have a heat map or a histogram. Let's change something. Instead of red, let's make it orange. All right, great. So now we're getting farther along and so forth. As you continue through the courses, you will see how your skills will improve. You'll understand different types of data, different methods. You'll learn how to code. And eventually, you can take this off from this playground onto your computer.